is going on gamers and members of the gaming nation? I am Buddy8760 Gaming of Gamers Card, and welcome back to yet another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Uh, in the last episode, well, we got some dodos. These aren't our dodos, but uh, in between episodes, I did a little bit of work on the house, and I died four times, so I am quite far from the house. Like, I have to go off in that direction to get to the house. We might have lost one of our dodos. So that's... That's great, because they, they don't know how to sit still. And we have to go through not only a... Uh, um... Do we have to go back home? But there's also not only a creature sitting at home waiting for us, but there's also an area along the beach where there's creatures waiting for us. So this is going to be fun. I'm just going to collect a little, a little bit of wood and make some tools, so that way I have at least some protection on the way home. See, so yeah, that's fun. Let's see, crafting, what, I need stones, I forgot, alright, one, now I'm going to craft myself another pick, this is the fourth pick I've made in the span of two nights. getting tedious. So, okay, give me an axe and a torch just in case I need it. Alright, now we're going to head off in this direction. Now I'm hoping, oh it's just that, I'm hoping that there's nothing too dangerous along the way home. Like that thing. Where the heck did those guys come from? Up onto the rock. Yep, I'm surrounded. No. Oh, brother. This guy literally came out of nowhere. Where do I have to go? And, of course, there's jellyfish in the water. And there's sharks, too. Is anything blocking my way running up there? No. Alright. Let's do it. Up I go. Oh no. Shoot. Shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay. I'm dead. He's coming right toward me. Please move. Please turn. Please go away. No. Go away. He's going to see me. He's going to see me. He's going gonna, gonna, gonna to be aggroed at me. He just pooped. He's coming this way. Stop coming this way. I don't have any means of protection. All I have is height. Hmm. 
Oh, really? Really? You're going to come right up to the foot of this mountain? Thank God. I can't do anything with that level yet. Go away, go away, go away, go away. Go away, oh, keep going away, keep going away. I gotta go that direction. Come freaking on. I think you're far enough away. Can I just sneak around behind you? Without being noticed? Yes, okay, go, 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 freaking go. Oh, those those dinosaurs quite literally came out of nowhere. Alright. Now that I'm safe, I am going to level up. Let's see, what do I want to level up? Let's do movement speed. Alright, and then we're going to tackle some engrams. We are at level 10 now, so there's a lot of engrams that we, need to, we still need to do. First off... Bow and arrows. What do we need for bows? A bow requires wood and fiber. Alright. I can craft a bow very quickly. I think it's the arrows I'm going to have the most trouble with. Too close for comfort. Alright, I did get some fibers as well. Alright. Back into here. Alright. Can I craft a bow yet? Oh, I need a lot more fibers. Arrows up. Oh, arrows are easy. I just need fibers galore. I can probably get those, okay. I'm gonna climb up on top of this. Nope, can't climb on top of that rock. Oh, great. And nighttime's coming. The best time to be outside with, with dinosaurs that can see at night. Deadly predators. Come on. No. You're over there, okay. Fibers. Keep. No, don't jump. Keep collecting fibers. Come on. How many fiber more fibers do I need? Four more fibers. She's in the range of everything. coming this way. He's coming directly at me. There's a dodo bird. There probably will be no progress made on the house in this episode because I'm just cowering from 
Ah, I didn't get very many fibers out of that. Kind of away from all these low-level carnivores that will eat me. Come on. Yes. I got enough fiber. Go, 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 go. Freaking go. Back into my alcove. All right. Let's do this. Bow. How many arrows can I make? I can make two arrows. All right. Ah, I need more fiber for more arrows. All right. Inventory. This is actually good that I made this at one point, because I'm going to need this in the future. But I need to get to a vantage point where using this isn't going to result in the thing just seeing me. I just defected. go. I don't see him. Is that him? That's him. Alright. No, 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 no. Oh, well. Freaking. No, I'm dead. I'm dead. Where? Oh, my gosh. Did I? Oh, my gosh. I killed it. I actually killed it. I am not a wimp after all. Oh, but I'm seriously hurt. Oh, gosh, that was bad. Oh, gosh. Up the mountain. Yeah, come at me, boy. Come at me, boy. Oh, you're going that way? You're going that way? Oh, brother. He's going to spot me. He's going to run straight at me. Alright. I don't think I died with anything on me the last time. Yeah. Absolutely nothing sad really okay oh I'm going to just wait the night out because this is gonna be ridiculous whoa this is new I decided to do some walking instead of just sit around while I waited for night to pass and up the beach I found this thing no I want you to What do I do with you? Do I?
Ooh. Show text. Surviving on my own has been a constant struggle, even with the aid of my beasts. There is always so much to do, but I must remember to rest. Toiling by starlight can be dangerous, and I work more efficiently after a night's sleep in my bed. The extra stamina I have when I'm fully rested can prove far, pr pr prove far more useful than what little I accomplish when my eyes are heavy with exhaustion. Yet time is so precious, and I cannot afford to oversleep. Thankfully, I a caravan that I was hired to protect gave me a device called an alarm clock that clangs and shrills when it's time to wake up. Oh my gosh, dude. The sound is quite annoying, but I suppose that is the point. Huh. Nice. So, okay. Oh, another level up. I also decided to go for a, uh, a double, um, a, a two times, um, experience thing. So now we are at level 12. Let's see what we need. Um, let's get... Uh, what do we need? What do we need? We're level 12, so we can do all this stuff up here. Ooh. I'll apply those when we get back to the base. So see whatever we need. Okay. So now I'm going to pick up my torch. That's not a torch. 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 There we go. I'm going to continue my journey by night. There we go. This is what I was trying to do, get up on top of this ledge before morning. It looks like morning is fast approaching. Oh, I, I hear a beast. Okay. Let's see, what are you? You look like a bear. I know that other creature over there is harmless, but you I'm not so sure about. What are you? I really don't know if you're a good creature or not, but whatever you are, I'm not sticking around to find out. I have to get back home and take care of my dodos. Or, depending on how many are left, dodo or nothing. What oh, is a void? I've also got to take care of whatever is stalking my base that killed me last time. That is a destination I have to get to, right over there. Alright, let's check the navigation kit. So I have to travel along this ridge for quite a ways. Okay. I know you won't hurt me. I've kind of gotten used to some of the dinosaurs around here. But... The freak go! Get you guys are hostile. Freaking... Freaking... Okay. No, don't change view. Oh. oh my freaking gosh! I got killed by a bug! Those things aren't to be messed with, and I'm even further away than where I started my trek. Oh, great. Lovely.
not even on the same continent or same island it looks like <sighs> of course go away Oh, it's you. You're here, of course. Great. Lovely. Thanks for being here. You as well. You too. Run. And hear it frickin'. Frickin'. Oh, just kill me already! Kill me already! <sighs> Just respawn. Did I respawn in the exact same location? Great. Yep. Ah. Beautiful. Ah. I'm not gonna make you guys sit through this. When I get home, I'll I'll let I'll, I'll let you guys know. This is this is freaking ridiculous. All right, so I've made it pretty far. Um, not as far as I would have liked to, but I've been able to avoid some things, except falling off a cliff. Kinda hurt, just a little bit. Um, my goal is actually to get to that obelisk over there because it might have some good tier one stuff that I can use on the rest of my track home. Maybe something that I, maybe some good armor. Because right now all I've got is cloth armor and it's back at my base. <sighs> Luckily I landed in a non-threatening zone, but there's a threatening zone over there. I don't know about, about everywhere else. I'm just waiting for my health to go back up and then I can continue on.